Okay, first time ever recording a video about succulents. Um, I just wanted to show you guys um, where you can collect seeds from your succulents. Um, I just did this for the first time today and uh, was pleasantly surprised with the results. So this is a Echeveria Blue Waves, I believe, and um, it has shot up its inflorescence, those cymes, I believe they're called. And uh, those have been up for about, I want to say, three weeks, four weeks, something like that. Anyway, some of them are still going strong, um, just begging to be pollinated by some sort of um, creature, bee, or what have you. But um, these ones that have dried up and shriveled up here, um, these are where you get the seeds from. And it's really cool. You just basically take it and um, pluck it off. And um, I'll, I'll attach another video or, or uh, append a video to this one to show you guys um, exactly what you can expect to find when you open up one of these little um, flowers. So uh, yeah, this is Edgeberry Blue Waves. This is uh, in the Bay Area. And it's May 1st, so um, it's a great time to be looking for seeds from your succulents. As you can tell, um, not just blue waves, but there's um, inflorescence popping up from uh, flowers everywhere. So um, yeah, it's harvest time. Okay, well we're back from the garden, and I wanted to show you guys um, what, uh, what to do with your... Um, seeds, your little seed pods, uh, once you collect them, <clears throat> when you pull them off the, the inflorescence stalk, they'll, they'll look kind of like this. Um, having problems with my focus, but they'll look brown and shriveled and dried up and you they, they may not attract much attention at all, but um, this is where the seeds are. So if you peel back those, those little uh, sepals, petals, um, what you'll find is um, at the core you'll find this and there's these little pods in here that contain thousands or I should I don't know about thousands yeah, maybe thousands thousands of little tiny echeveria seeds um, and you basically bust these uh, little pods open and and I don't know if you could see very well but um, they're in there by the thousands tons of them in there and when you bust them open and uh, and and let the seeds fall out onto white paper um, they really show up really well so this is what you can um, uh, this is this is what Echeveria seeds look like at least for Echeveria blue waves so really really small I'll add a little ruler so you get an idea of just how small we're talking about that's um, those are centimeters and millimeter markings there on, on my ruler so it gives you an idea of just how small they are so yeah this is Roger Ward uh, signing out. I hope you liked the video.